Hi everybody, welcome back to World of Final Fantasy. I've been kind of leveling up a lot of my mirages and doing stuff, but I guess that's all irrelevant because we got some more plot to go through. You know, we got, we've been getting some rumbling sounds. Oh my gosh, how many of them are wriggling around down there? Well, whatever the answer is, don't tell me! These things have been under us the whole time? More than you can possibly be imagined. Ah, I said don't tell me about it! Well, it turns out that I gotta go defeat a couple, but before I do I that, this. might as well get a little bit of an insight, right? Uh, in unimprisonable, you know, it's like, so we're just gonna kill them, just kind of gonna destroy them, a little bit of a boss fight, everybody. Some of you might be like, oh, goody, how, how do I manage the things, the things that I contain right now? Oh, man, I... I one hit, one hit, just one guy. Well, you ask me. Let's let's get rid of this guy. Let's get some overkill going on. Let's get some warrior blight. Let's get me attempting to play some Final Fantasy. I will banish this darkness once and for all. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Now, if I was. What is that? Auspicious thing? Oh, that seems fantabulous. Let's see, what else do we got going on for us? Um. Let, let's try the Aroa. They're pretty weak to that. They kind of died to that. You know what? I think I think the Warrior of Light his is pretty cool. But let's get some Final Heaven going up in this pitch. Cause let's be honest, Final Heaven is success. Hell yeah! Critical and everything, that is what we need up in here. This is going on. You know what? Fuck you, Earthworm Jim. I don't need you here now. You're unimprisonable. I don't give a shit about you. No You're just another me. faceless mirage that I'm just gonna plow through. Oh my god, look at all those levels. That is fantabulous. Guy drum, some armor gems, an earth hammer or two. You know what? This is pretty good. Cutscene, everybody. Are you trying to get killed? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Take it. 
I don't know what you did, but thanks. Save it for later. Hmm? The longer we all stay out here, the shorter we'll live. <gasps> Dude, what? <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Come on. Right. Oh, got it. <laughs> well, that was interesting. I mean, granted, it's lightning, and I had a little mini rant about Final Fantasy XIII, but I, I'll take you over snow. I just want to forget those sandworms ever existed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fuck those guys. The moon is a thing of beauty tonight. You sound really creepy, like, oh man, I'm gonna stalk some prey tonight or something. Surprising. I never thought the giants from the hills would have so much trouble crossing a desert. Oh, so then you've heard of us. Why are you so happy hmm. about that? Trust me, we do not want fame. This'll warm you right up. <laughs> oh, thanks. <clears throat> oh, what well, thanks for you. Keys from the prophecy? Interesting. That explains some things. Hmm? So you've heard of them? I don't suppose you can tell us more. There are four. Earth, fire, water, and shadow, if I remember correctly. You wouldn't also happen to know where the keys are hidden. <laughs> Is something wrong? Oh, sorry. I've never heard exactly where the keys might be hidden. But listen. I might know something about that. Really? The key of Earth lies in the cradle of Mako's light. The key of tides, that one lies in the temple in the deep. The key of shadows lies in the land of naught but night. Oh, that sounds nice and specific. Wait, is that from the Crimson Prophecy's missing verse? Yes. You know much, Traveler. Time out. What is this missing verse? They say that part of the original prophecy was omitted from subsequent copies. However, to be able to read that... Oh, I haven't read it myself. I heard it from someone who has. And Bahamut's Castle? You, uh, probably don't know that much. How would she know where that is? I don't know. But there are whispers. What? Seriously? This is merely a rumor, but they say the castle you seek, the domain of the heralds and their king, lies past the crystal tower, beyond the path of the gods. Heralds? So then, the king who found a Bahamut. Cool. So, all we have to do is get those four keys, and then haul Heine over to the crystal tower, am I right? Yeah, from the sound of it. <sighs> All this reassuring info is making me sleepy. <sighs> Don't yawn, Lon. You're making me yawn, too. <sighs> what do you say we just turn in here for the day? Yeah, okay. Good night, Brain. Good night.
We were careless. The drinks last night. What? They were. Dude, my body. I can barely. No heroics, please. Hey now, that is certainly no way for us to treat a lady. Or as I frequently say, the churl never gets the girl. <laughs> Rubbish. Who's the knight? The Federation. Who else could it be? I believe our arrangement said the giants were mine to attend to. Attend to? That sounds awfully churlish to me. Ah, uh, but no. See, you may be a giant, but my attention, I say for real grown-ups. That's it! Nobody talks to her like that! <laughs> Let's try to keep things civil if you don't mind. Please don't struggle. What is going on? I... I don't know. <laughs> oh man, I got lightning as every med medallion medal. Man, that's, that's pretty sweet. I guess I'll save my progress. Actually, no, I'm not gonna, because I just want to continue on with the, the plot of everything. Chapter 14 Lost Powers Sis, are you okay? I think so. Are you okay? Yeah, except what did they do? Ow! Also, like, what is this place? Oh boy! It looks like we got some pretty interesting dialogue up ahead of us. Uh, we got some, we got some things, you know, some prisms, some explanation marks. We got some talking. This guy's pretty quiet, so I don't. I guess there's not really a whole lot of dialogue going on with the part. Oh, that guy's pretty quiet, too. He doesn't really have a lot to say about the upcoming part. Um, maybe you, you. Man, everybody, everybody's pretty, pretty. Oh, man, you got something. I, I recognize. Excuse me. Do you know where we are? Huh? Giants, eh? <laughs> now, what did you do to get thrown into this sorry place? Huh? <laughs> This is a prison situated beneath Figaro Castle. Dude, prison? For real? Well, they call it prison, but it's more like a death sentence. That can't be! There must be a way out of here! Oh, wouldn't that be nice? But you can forget about it. You won't find any human guards, because much worse is on patrol. Sentient machines that hunt down all who try to escape. Just surviving down here is a small miracle. Sentient machines? They're not mirages? How's a lowly prisoner like me to know? But I suppose that they must not be. When the King of Figaro stumbled upon this place some years ago, he decided to enlist help from folks at Shinra. But then all the machines that Shinra brought in, they started attacking people, as if they had minds of their own. Ultimately, the site was abandoned, and now the worst of Figaro's criminals are sent here to rot. I but got that. Are you two heading out? Then you better watch your back. One more thing. I've managed to stockpile some supplies. Best prices in prison. Everybody got that? We can't return to Nimewood Hills. We're we're stuck here. This is this is kind of a deadlock. Just you're gonna die here. 
What in the... That would be the castle submerging. Now that I think of it, the castle did seem to appear out of nowhere. I hear the first time they poked around here, the castle plowed forward, and they ended up having to redraw all the maps. At least that's the story. This is oddly familiar. Final Fantasy VIII. Cause I remember that game. I played through it once when I was a teenager and it was oddly very specific of that time, but I digress. Uh, we got a bunch of plot, kind of a plot dump. Um, you know what, I'm gonna end it off here next time. A lot of shit.